Now for some pop news. We have Mona coming back to, to make us all feel a little cool again. Uh, I mean, I could be the smartest person in the room, but I can't think of a five-letter word to start this off. So let's just go ahead and begin pop news with some music news. Lizzo is back and feeling good as hell. The singer announced her new album special will drop on July 15th, and she is also sharing a new music video for her latest single. Take a look. That song is called, well, let me give you the morning TV appropriate version. About dang time, I'll let you Google the actual version. Lizzo writing on Instagram, have you been feeling stressed? Have you also been feeling sexy? Well, I got a remedy for you. Uh, Whit Johnson actually complains a lot about this, right? Uh. You're always so conflicted. The first part of the stress, yes. <laughs> Mm. You're so conflicted. I feel it. I feel it. <laughs> well, we uh, we saw Zareen talk about Quest Love. Well, next up is Quest Love's Oscar award-winning concert film, and it is inspiring a new Harlem Renaissance. The documentary called Summer of Soul, or When the Revolution Could Not Be Televised, features long-lost footage of 1969's Harlem Cultural Festival. Well, now the film has inspired a reboot of the music celebration. The reimagined event will be called the Harlem Music Festival of Culture and will be held in 2023 at Marcus Garvey Park, the same location as the original. Organizers say with this initiative, we want to create something that evokes that same sense of pride in our community that uh, we felt on that special day in 1969. There's not a lot that can get me to go uptown, but this, I will take <laughs> I the one train for it. <laughs> we were talking about music festivals. Uh -huh. By 2023, we could feel comfortable going to one. Oh, yeah. We can make sure. this, right? We'll Challenge get there. We'll get there summer anyways. Listen, <laughs> um, no comment. But can you finally believe, okay, this one is going to make you guys feel old, that this bop, is celebrating its 25th anniversary. That's right. Mm bop, <laughs> bada bada boom bop, shot to the top of the charts after it debuted back in 1997. And now Hanson is looking back on that hit that made them pop stars. But according to the Hanson brothers, the song is more than a ditty with no meaning. The trio telling the New York Post, quote, the song is all about the passage of time and how very few things will last. But there is one thing that has lasted, their love for music. Hanson is still making it and even has a new album called Red, Green, Blue that drops May 20th, followed by a tour. You guys, the Hansons walked so the Jonas Brothers could run. Oh, no. hey. a whole okay. word. Yes. Um, bop. Um, bop. <laughs> that, that was a very good point, Mona. I take that. Thank you, Mona. <laughs> Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.